12 Eco-Friendly Pest Control Methods There are several organic pest control approaches that are not extensively publicized. They produce a good substitute to chemical insecticides and do not negatively influence the atmosphere in humans. The eco-friendly pest control procedures are appropriate for your house and the lawn. Natural insecticides are less lethal to the atmosphere, mammals, and marine creatures. Some are very operative natural pest control procedures. Before using biodegradable pesticides, you should make sure that you have suitably prepared your lawn before implanting it. Appropriate land preparation guarantees that you are making the most friendly growing situation for your garden plants. A healthy lawn is an ideal pest control accessible. A healthy lawn confirms healthy plants that invite fewer pests. When pests attack the plants, they are better prepared to protect themselves contrary to the insects and recover rapidly. When we talk about accepting the best pest control plan, you should recognize the relevant pest. This lets you accept a control technique that only kills the specific pest. This makes sure that you use a particular control process that will not eliminate useful insects. Additionally, natural pest control approaches do not have rapid action as chemical pesticides, but they are very operative. The most common methods are given below. 1. Insectary plants. Plants that invite useful bugs to your lawn are called insectary plants. Insectary plants include mint, basil, and marigold. These insectary plants can create nectar, which invites the honey bee, which is the best pollinator. Additionally, honey bee keeps insects at bay. 2. Attract mammals and birds. In your lawn, it is essential to create a favorable environment that invites birds and approachable mammals. This will improve the look of your lawn and naturally eliminates insects and ailments. Furthermore, you will not have to use artificial fungicides and pesticides that are dangerous for your well-being. To invite birds to the lawn, you can place nesting cases and feeders. After that, birds will help eradicate worms, snails, and other insects that damage the crops. 3. Diatomaceous Earth It is a harmless powder prepared by algae shells, which are enclosed in sharp prognoses that impose physical harm to a pest. Then the pest releases significant body fluids causing dehydration and, ultimately, the death of pests. Excitingly, diatomaceous earth is not toxic to insects, however, it only harms the pest physically. The action successfully contradicts soft-bodied insects like trips, maggots, snails, ants, lice, and roaches. Additionally, this pest control technique is non-selective, which can cause the death of useful insects too. Diatomaceous earth can be scattered to hard-to-reach parts or used to the earth for ground residence insects or greenery for additional pests. After applying to greenery, it is perfect for doing it timely in the morning as it follows to moist greenery. 4. Do covering. Covering has always been an important farming habit. It permits you to work smoothly instead of hard on your lawn. Appropriate mulching is a biodegradable pest control technique. It helps decrease soil destruction, stops the progress of weed, generates a suitable environment that changes plants' growth, and reduces daylight and rain's detrimental effects. 5. Neem Oil It is obtained from the neem tree. It works a toxic and nauseating for several pests. It also disinfects certain kinds of pests and stops the development cycle of several pests. It can be used as a foliar spray and can be applied to kill insects like loppers, aphids, fleas, and mealy microorganisms. Similarly, neem oil is operative against leaf juveniles as the plants get the neem abstracts through their roots. Thus, it is significant to note that it can be deadly when swallowed, however, it is safe for mammals. This method should only be applied when essential, and only on the insects you are pointing to. This will reduce the death of useful pests. 6. Insecticidal Cleansers These cleansers include the salts and fatty acids to target several soft-bodied insects comprising aphids, fleas, mealy microbes, worms, thrips, and the initial phases of scale. The detergents enter the pest's soft external shell, resulting in harm to the cuticle of the pests. They then start to collapse, causing dryness and hunger finally. They can be phytotoxic to specific plants, hence examining a small region before using it on a huge scale. The other disadvantage is that cleansers are non-selective, thus, they can be lethal to useful insects. 
Use them carefully with any insecticide. Insecticidal soaps are non-toxic to people and other animals. You can generate your own by using a small amount of dish soap along with cooking oil within a spray bottle. They are also easily available for acquisition at stores or in garden provisions. 7. Insecticidal oils. They work by asphyxiating the pests. Insecticidal oils stop the oxygen delivery to the pests. This biodegradable pest control technique mainly kills the ova and pests, which are not completely matured. Insecticidal oils do affect useful pests, however, they are less harmful to them. They can be used to eradicate spider lice, mealy microbes, and psylla. But, before using insecticidal oils, ensure you read the instructions of use. If you overlook how to apply them, they can damage your plants, mainly by causing leaf destruction. 8. Microbial insecticides. Such insecticides cause insects to become sick, and they are very precise to the specific pest. Furthermore, they do not harm useful pests, and they are non-toxic to animals. One of the most prevalent options is Bacillus thuringiensis. You can use this on every occasion to treat several worm maggots from hornworms to cutworms. In addition to that, the bacteria Bacillus thuringiensis block the digestive tract of the larva. After doing this, they stop ingesting, and within a few days, all of the pests are expired. 9. Resist birds, squirrels, and rabbits. Some birds, squirrels, and rabbits can harm plants. You should not use chemical substances to get rid of these pests. By using shiny balloons made out of metal, you can resist them. In addition to that, you only have to cut glossy balloons into perpendicular strips and then hang these strips from poles nearby your crops. 10. Steady Leaf Examination One of the better and most operative methods of controlling insects in your lawn is by doing steady leaves examination. If the plants are unhealthy or seem stained, they are expected to invite insects to the lawn. It is significant to eliminate all unhealthy or sick plants from your lawn ASAP. Furthermore, healthy leaves that do not have any disease are less expected to invite damaging microbes and other insects. Similarly, be sure to stop weeds as they create a favorable environment for detrimental insects. 11. Get assistance from an expert pest control worker. If you truly want to confirm you are using the perfect pesticide or an ideal pest control procedure on your lawn, you should obtain the right information from an expert. Some solutions cannot do well for everybody. This is one of the several motives for getting assistance from an expert pest control worker. Such specialists will examine your garden and suggest the perfect pest control approaches that are not detrimental to plants and your health. 12. Pyrethrin. Pyrethrin is one of the prevalent botanical insecticides you should know about. It is the dynamic ingredient obtained from the pyrethrum daisy. Goods having pyrethrin hold compounds that exterminate on contact. They are deliberated broad spectrum and are applied to control several chewing and splashing pests. Do not obscure pyrethrin with the artificial version known as pyrethroid. Pyrethrin is even more deadly to all pests. Use attentiveness once using pyrethrin items because they are harmful to fish and temperately lethal to mammals. Additionally, they are detrimental and non-selective to some useful pests containing lady beetles. Furthermore, insecticides having pyrethrum are of specific apprehension for mosquito regulation. Even though it is promoted as an organic way of solving the problem, and the mist utilized to eradicate the mosquitoes is toxic to several other pests, containing honeybees and further useful insects.